Welcome to this week's JBA Coach to Coach Video of the Week, brought to you by Netlink Sports, the preferred court provider of the JBA. Hi, my name is Ann Cordes from Kiva, and I'm here to talk about some bad habits of setting. Uh, one of the bad habits we talk about all the time are, is bad footwork. Another bad habit we'll see are people taking, starting their hands from way too low position and then going to like slap at the ball. And then the last bad habit we see a lot is just follow through. That's footwork and then hands falling through to the target or actually the bad habit is falling away from the target or falling on top of the ball or even actually too far underneath the ball. So we'll start with a couple things that we see as bad habits and some drills that we can do to change them. Thanks for tuning in. All right, some of the, the bad habits we talk about a lot are just footwork. And we want that to be left right and if you're seeing their feet right now they're not using them correctly and so we're looking for left right we're looking for power when you're a younger setter and then obviously direction and location um, is our most important reason that we like to use left right set so when we put that emphasis on left right set we actually like to say it left right set for our setters left right set good and so they're finishing even if it's just a transfer of weight onto that toe so that ball is going straight the ball gets pushed too far to the right. A lot of times you see setters push back. We want them to use their feet to get back behind the ball and push forward. And that is just a drill we do a ton of reps for better footwork. Another bad habit we see a lot of times are kids taking, uh, drawing their hands low, not meeting that ball higher. Um, so one thing we like to do is keep tossers really close, like 10 foot line or in front of 10 foot line so that they can get very comfortable with taking the ball higher, okay? So go ahead and let's try to take that ball higher and get comfortable. You don't need as much power, so you're not gonna feel the need to slap at the ball when you're staying closer. And then what we want to do is slowly but surely back the tosser up. So after they 10 really good balls from taking it high and they're really comfortable, then we can back up. The progression to that is obviously getting, getting deeper into the court, maybe going off a free ball, going off a down ball, going off a serve ball, that's your progression to take the ball higher. One of the last bad habits we see uh, for setters and non setters and Caveros is not finishing with our uh, hands in the ball from target. So you can watch the hands kind of going all over the place right now. Whichever direction they go, they're pulling their hands apart, hands over the ball, hands flaring out to the side. So, what we want them to do is when they step left, right, we want them to finish that follow through with their hands, finishing right on target so that they're checking themselves off. At the finish of the, when they finish their set here. Here we go. There you go. So left right. So we do the same drills that we do with uh, setters a lot of times with liberos. There we go. And thank you for watching the JVA Coach to Coach video, video of, of the week. week.